on the New Orleans Saints. 13-3 last year, won the division. Uh, really should have been in the Super Bowl. but That was my Super Bowl team last year, and I almost hit the nail on the head with the Saints of the Patriots. Yep. Division champions, their odds are minus 160. Strength of schedule is 13th. So, easiest schedule in the division. Turnover margin, they were number seven last year at plus eight. Head coach Sean Payton, of course, we trust him. Offensive guru, he's the guy. Drew Brees, of course, with him. Their over-under is 10.5. To go over is plus 110 to go over. Uh, to go under is minus 130. On offense, total yards per play, they were number seven last year. They averaged 5.9. Their offensive coordinator, Pete Carmichael, he's been there for quite a while. Uh it is it's strange hard. to me that he's never gotten a head coach in the interview. Yeah, it's a little When a little the weird. league is just going offensive genius, but... Well, I think everybody believes it's Peyton. Well, right? they don't believe that it's Sean McVay, but I everybody's know, right? hiring anybody who's related to him. I just, I, I don't get Like, it. that logic doesn't make sense. No, it really doesn't. Go uh, ahead. Signed tight end Jared Cook and running back Latavius Murray and center Nick Easton, all of which will be playing significant minutes this year. That's right. On defense, total yards per play, they were number... 18 in the league, gave up 5.7. Defensive coordinator is Dennis Allen. They signed defensive tackle Malcolm Brown and defensive tackle Mario Edwards, both of which will be backups this coming season. They are a projected favorite in 12 games this year. Really good. I've got them at 11-5. and five. I understand that the juice on the over 10.5 is plus 110. I don't care. I'm going 11-5. and five. I like the schedule. I like the team. I think they are fired up after they felt like the NFL screwed them last year. And they did. And they did. And this year, I think this is... Now, Drew, I understand. Drew Brees, at the end of the season... Now, they just paid Michael Thomas and just exorbitant amount of money. Um, but I think that's okay. They still got Alvin Kamara. They got all these guys. Like that Ted Ginn Jr., he's a speedster, all this kind of mess. I think this team goes 11-5. and five, And I think that this is the, the last hurrah. Oh, no, this Drew is... Brees. They're all in this year. Yeah. There's, I understand that his passing efficiency went down at the, the second half of last season. That's right. That's because the defenses they were playing Correct. got significantly I agree better. With that. But they were still playing winning football. I think they're going to do the same thing this year. I I wonder how much they'll miss Mark Ingram because he was he was the between the tackles well, guy. But Murray is good. By all measurable stats, Latavius Murray's been better than Mark Ingram. But Every, but everybody in football that's not a Bama guy. Gary, agrees that, that this is an upgrade at backup. Okay, okay. So, I mean, we, we shall see. Alvin Kamara, we'll see what's going on. You, I'm, can, hear, you can hear all the you hear my dog jangling. Jangling, I apologize. <laughs> um, I've got them 13-3. and three. I love this team. And I, and I do think that they – so basically, if you look at what they've done salary cap-wise, and, and I'm not a cap guru, I kind of read other people and they kind of tell me these things – and, and I get a lot of this from Kevin Clark. That guy's a cap guy. He understands how it works. And he talks a lot about they have pretty much mortgaged the future salary-wise the last two to three years, going all in on Drew Brees' last couple of years. And and I, I think that if there's a team at the trade deadline that's going to make a move to try to get that big player or whatever, I think this team is going to do everything it takes to go all in on this team. Yeah. I think they're really good. I think Sean Payton is an exceptionally good head coach. And I think they got a lot of fire from last year. I think so, too. I, I don't see them losing many games <laughs> at all. I think they're going to be one of these teams that are going to take it personally, and they're coming at the league. Yeah, I'm with you. All right, you ready for the last one? Come on. 